This goby fish in Hawaii can climb up 300 foot waterfalls. And physics students from the University of Leicester have determined that because of the Doppler effect, hyperspace travel would really look like this. Vsauce, Kevin here. This is Mind Blow. A clothing store in Japan has a hanger system that displays video of a model wearing the clothes you remove from the rack. The hangers have simple on-off switches depending on if the article of clothing is hanging or is picked up and each have a unique ID that is tied to a PC in the back, which displays a photo or video of the model wearing that piece of clothing. It's kind of a digital take on mannequins, but it's really more of a novelty to try to get online shoppers back into brick and mortar stores. These LED ice cubes let you know when you've had too much alcohol. Developed by an MIT Media Lab researcher, the edible gelatin ice cubes hold a coin cell battery, a microcontroller, and a transceiver to track the number of sips and total time drinking. They flash and sync with ambient music and change color to represent the levels of intoxication. Aspire Bariatrics has developed a system that allows people to lose weight by emptying their stomach with a valve after a meal. Aspiration therapy involves a tube in the stomach connected to a skin port that can be opened to empty stomach contents before they pass into the intestines where the calories are absorbed. And then you just dump the stuff in the toilet. So yeah, this is a new found fossil of a giant dolphin shaped predator considered to be the T-Rex of the sea. Velociroach is the second fastest legged robot, clocking in at 3.2 meters per second. It moves like a real cockroach with its legs hitting the ground 15 times per second. And this cardboard roach can move 26 times its body length in only one second. And also can carry four times its weight. Diego-san is a humanoid robot toddler that combines advancements in robotics, neuroscience, computer vision, developmental psychology, and machine learning. Developed at the University of California, San Diego, it mimics the expressions of a one-year-old child, and the plan is to use it in studies on sensory motor and social development, basically how babies learn to control their bodies and interact with others. The Power Loader Power Amplification Exoskeleton Robot is being developed by Panasonic subsidiary ActiveLink. It's a full body exoskeleton designed to carry over 220 pounds. And they hope to use a more compact version for use in the reconstruction of the Fukushima Daiichi nuclear power plant. Finally, photographer Katka Praskova took 7,100 photos in 730 hours to create this time-lapse compilation of 22 flowers. with a disco clam, a type of clam that produces its own light show. And as always, thanks for watching.